the future really looks bright for the Middle Fork Beargrass Creek with the approval of a watershed plan for Louisville. The EPA approved uh, the plan which brings together water professionals from here in Louisville and Louisville MSD and also with the Kentucky Division of Water with residents and businesses and other concerned citizens who value this urban waterway. Approval of the plan itself is an opportunity for us to pursue additional fan funding through the state's 319H grant funding, which really is an opportunity for us to look at specific opportunities to deal with non-point source uh, pollution for this watershed. Now you might ask, well, what is non-point source <laughs> pollution? Non-point source pollution happens when it rains or you have snow melt or any other type of impacts uh, that moves over the ground. And as it moves over the ground, it picks up uh, debris. It also picks up uh, natural and human-made pollutants. And it also uh, picks up trash and other things that ultimately can deposit into the waterway. So today we selected the community park here in St. Matthews as a really great example of two different types of best management practices that we're hoping to implement throughout the watershed. So two things that have been done here very successfully are one is we have a rain garden over here to our left, which captures and treats the water from the impervious surface, that parking lot out there. A really great natural way to treat uh, stormwater runoff allows us to capture those pollutants that we talked about in this watershed plan. But we also have um, a really great example of a restored channel uh, that you can actually take a walking path and the community is able to enjoy and see it uh, thrive through the restoration project that was done previously. And so these are the types of projects we are hoping to see um, be implemented through the, the um, watershed plan.